This is home to the Hendersons. It looks like any normal family home, but inside lurks a troubled mind of Erin, a boy who made himself an outcast from society. Well, we've been together since we were very small. We got married not long after we met. We moved into this house a few years ago with our children. Our daughter Hattie is very bright. Brilliant grades all the way through school and college. Now she's at university in Staffordshire doing media production. Yeah, she's a real high flyer. We're really proud of her. That must be nice. So can you tell us about your son, Erin? Well, Erin used to be a really happy boy. We were a really close family, but that all changed a few months back. He's turned into a bit of an airhead. And why do you think this has happened? Well, it started when my mother passed on. I think he's felt rather deflated since then, so we got him Flo, but he died somehow. And then what happened? Dun, 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 dun. We think Aaron may have had something to do with it. He started to drift further and further away from us. He got tangled up in the wrong crowd, you see. Every night he, he comes home really high. But we found a clinic called the Derek Curtis Rehabilitation Clinic. I personally founded the clinic back a few years ago. I find that the best way to deal with these kids is the harsh reality of detox. We lock them in a room, they go in high. After a day or two, these kids are at the lowest point they can be. Gradually over the next few days, these kids regain their senses and leave happy customers. Yeah, woo, woo, yeah, yeah. Our motto with the kids is hold tight, this may hurt. <laughs> yeah, harsh some I say, but it works. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, hey, get the f out. What are you bloody doing in here? F off, you f cunt. Okay, are you ready? Suppose. Where do you see yourself in this family? Dunno. Are you close to your mum and dad? Not really. And why's that? Dunno. Would you be willing to sit down with your parents and try and talk things through? Suppose. Erin, uh, wh what would you like to say to your parents? Dunno. Please Erin, just say something. Something. See, this is how he gets. Maybe if you tell us how you feel. I feel like you don't know me anymore. You're both so proud of Fatty. She is your sister. Call her Hattie. <laughs> Whatever. Okay, well, Erin, we have organised for you and your family to go away on a holiday to Disneyland, but on one condition, and that is that you go to the clinic. <laughs> Okay. Oh, that's brilliant. brilliant.